Here given a right angle triangle ABC, the side AC which is the hypotenuse is 277 cm. The perimeter is 644 cm. We have to find the other two missing sides BC and AB. Now let's consider the side AC which is the hypotenuse as the lowercase c, AB is lowercase a and BC is lowercase b. According to Pythagorean theorem, then c square is equal to a square plus b square that means hypotenuse is equal to sum of squares of the other two sides under square root or we can say square of hypotenuse is equal to sum of squares of other two sides. So given a square plus b square is equal to c square, c is 277, so 277 square, let this be equation 1, perimeter is 644 centimeter, that means a plus b plus c is equal to 644 centimeter or a plus b if we put the value of c here that is 277 then a plus b plus 277 is 644 subtract 277 from both the sides we get a plus b is equal to 367 now if we square both the sides and expand it it will be a square plus b square plus 2ab is equal to 367 whole square or value of a square plus b square from equation 1 is 277 square plus 2ab is equal to 367 square. We send this to right hand side. So 2ab is equal to 367 square minus 277 square. Now this is in the form of differences of square a square minus b square then this is equal to a plus b times a minus b therefore 2ab is equal to 367 plus 277 times 367 minus 277 or 2ab is equal to 644 times 90 or AB is equal to 644 times 90 upon 2 or AB is equal to, we cut it, 2 times 45 is 90 and 644 times 45 is 28980. Now let's do A minus B whole square. If we expand it, it will be A square plus B square minus 2AB. A square plus B square is 277 a square plus b square is 277 square minus 2 a b is 2 times 2 8 9 8 0 or a minus b whole square is equal to 7 6 7 2 9 minus 5 7 9 6 0 or a minus b whole square is equal to 1, 8, 7, 6, 9. Now to remove the square, we square root both the sides. So this removes the square root or a minus b is equal to. Now to find the square root of such big numbers, what we do? We group the numbers in twos from backwards like this. And now we start dividing. So 1 times 1 is 1. So we write 1, 1 like this. We write 1 here. 1, 1 gets cancelled. You add these two, we write 1 plus 1, 2 here and bring down the two digits together, that is 87. Now you find a number which when is multiplied to itself gives you either equal to 87 or less than 87. Now 22 times 2 will be 44. If we write 3 here and 3 here, then it is 3 times 3 is 9 and 3 times 2 is 6. If we write 4 here, and then 4 here, 4 times 4 is 16 and 4 times 2 is 96, which will be bigger than 87. So, we write 3 here. So, you write 3 here and 3 here and 3 here, these are the quotient. Again, add them. 
you subtract here 1869. Now again we check with numbers. If we write 7 here and 7 here, then it will divide this number entirely. 7 times 7 is 49, 4 is carry over, 7 times 6 is 42, plus 4, 46. 4 here, carry over, 7 times 2 is 14, plus 4, 18. So we keep on dividing until the remainder is 0. You add them and if this quotient 137 is half of this number then your answer is correct or if this number is double of 137 you check then our answer is correct. So square root of 18769 is 137. So we write 137. Now in the quotient already given A plus B plus C is the perimeter of the triangle that is 644 and from this equation we calculated A plus B by subtracting the value of C here. So A plus B is 267. Now we have A plus B is 267. A minus B we let this be equation 2. So from equation 2 A minus B is 137. So A plus B is 367. A minus B we calculated 137. Now add them, this and this gets cancelled, a plus a is 2a is equal to 504 or a is equal to 504 upon 2 or a is equal to 252. So if a is 252, b is equal to 367 minus 252. So, B is equal to 115. So, A is 252, B is 115. This is our answer. We can check this. A is 252, B is 115. If A plus B plus C is equal to 644, then our answer is correct. So, 277 plus 252 plus 115. 7 plus 2, 9 plus 5, 14. 1 is carry over. 1 plus 1, 2 plus 5, 7. 7 plus 7, 14. 4, 1 carry over. 1 plus 1, 2. 2 plus 2, 4. 4 plus 2, 6. So, LHS is equal to RHS. Answer is verified. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.